even a little warmer today. Yeah, so we should make it into the 50s today, Patrick. Uh, away from the coastline at the coast, you'll be in the upper 40s to near 50 degrees. It's a warmer southwest wind. It's going to bring in those milder temperatures, but when you get that wind off the water, it's cool still. So let's take a look at conditions outside as you start your day down in Narragansett. You get the sun breaking through some passing clouds this morning. We're going to get back to uh, mostly sunny skies here as we hit the late morning and afternoon hours. But the warmer air is coming in this morning. It is leading to some cloud cover. So we see that in Providence, our threat tracker future cast for today, tonight, and into tomorrow. Um, is in the low category to start. We are watching showers for tomorrow. I am looking at about a half an inch of rainfall shouldn't cause any significant problems, but it's going to turn breezy and we're also going to see the potential for an isolated thunderstorm on Friday night. Now moving forward into the weekend behind that rain, those rain showers will come some cooler air for your Easter weekend. It's chilly to start this morning. 32 degrees in Providence, 30 New Bedford, 35 Newport, 34 in Smithfield. And you look at the radar and again, it's all quiet, chilly start, but partly cloudy skies for the morning. We'll get up to near 40 degrees here by mid to late morning hours and then into the 50s this afternoon. Here's the satellite and radar. So the clouds are courtesy of that warmer air coming in. While there's some precipitation to our north and west, it should dry up before reaching us. We'll just get that little batch of clouds passing through here and then back to sunshine for the afternoon. The clouds roll back in this evening and tonight, and you can see it's some widely scattered showers later tonight into tomorrow morning. Tomorrow, an unsettled day, off and on rainfall. I think the steadiest and heaviest of it still looks to be Friday evening through early Saturday morning. It's a cold front that'll be coming through our area and behind it, the temperatures do cool down. It's also going to turn pretty windy for Friday, gusts up to 40 miles per hour. Even today, we're going to see the winds picking up in the afternoon. So mid 50s, but kind of a gusty breeze. Pataka at 56, 55. Downtown Providence as you head along the water today, again a little cooler at the shore especially, but even along the east and west bays, we'll be at about 55 degrees. I'm forecasting a high in Newport, right around 50, 48 on Block Island. Cooler coast, brisk, dry conditions. Hope Valley at 54. Inland spots, we could see some upper 50s. Springfield to the air, but it's windy at times. Burville near 56, Johnston at 56, so the winds from the southwest 10 to 20 miles per hour with some gusts to 30 miles an hour. Seven day future cast only falling to 45 tonight and near 50 by this time tomorrow morning. Then we have the showers again off and on. They linger into Saturday morning, drier in the afternoon, wind gusts 30 to 40 miles per hour. Easter Sunday still looking cool and dry. 32 in the morning, mid to upper 40s in the afternoon. An increase in the clouds later in the day. We'll have to watch a front to our north. Could bring us a shower a Sunday evening or Sunday night. Looking kind of unsettled for next week. Starting with Tuesday, we'll bring back the chance for some showers and that may extend off and on into part of next weekend. But we do have a nice day on the way for today, and you can get more details.